knight 5 in game, Carl at level 8, with the same pack of companions he's been with for the quite some time already. And uh, let's level up Sarabun while we are here. Sarabun is the medic and uh, seems to be getting to a surgery 5 this time, which is excellent. Sarabun will be a firearm user, so let's up that. And Carl is on a quest to find the secret of the Black Maze. And in order to find out more about the Black Maze, Carl needs to find Janusz Ratzivil, who's the Prince of Lithuania, or the claimant to the throne of Polish Commonwealth. And um, since Janusz Ratzivil is a Lithuanian prince, I'm gonna take a wild guess and uh, try if um, try if uh, if Ratzivil is around the Lithuanian areas. Uh, while I'm getting there, I will uh, buy and sell some stuff. On the fortresses, I'll take a little loop through the south. The Muscovites are seizing the Crimean Canate fortress there, I see. Oh, you don't have any money. Why don't you have any money? Maybe I have sold you too many things. Right, but I already got my... Uh, Weapon. I'll sell some butter here as well. Yeah, that'll do. I do need a, some kind of a some kind of a helmet for Carl. Mm, I don't think I will be taking that. However, let's try the other fortress and sell the rest of the powder and butter. This is the place to sell the butter and the place to sell the powder as well. Okay. I don't think Ratchabil would be in the Lithuanian, I mean the Polish Polish towns, but uh, I'll I'll take a look, I'm not sure how uh, how well this game is uh, Game is done with that in mind. Colonel Zagloba, not gonna talk to him this time. Got the price for the wine, so let's let it go. I can buy some powder here and sell it on the fortresses as I move along. Yeah, just the powder will be enough. Check out Krakow as well. Here we have a ransom broker, and we have a pop visitor. Mm. You wouldn't be know about the claimants. Hmm. You can tell me where uh, where Shock de Clermont is, right? Okay. Can you tell me about the land? Tell me more. Yes, claimant, excellent, excellent. Yes, yes. I had a, f I had a faint recollection that this is possible. Oh, what the heck? You're kidding, right? I can't get the location of the. One and only claimant I actually want to find. You got to be kidding me. Uh. Figures. Mm, this 
might actually be considered a fort. Yeah. That only means I'm getting excellent price for my powder. The price of powder is going up. And I don't mind. No, not really. Yeah, I'll sell it all. Because you never know, I'll sec check Varsava as well. Ransom broker. Maybe this traveler knows where Ratsville is. No. That is um, <laughs> that is incredibly annoying. Why the why the option is there if it doesn't tell me? Oh man. Oh well. Find the Rotsville, it'll be interesting to interesting to see what uh, what he wants me to do. Oh, Victor is there. And Christina, one of the one of the claimants. Still don't remember if Vilna is considered a town or not. It is a town. Would Ratsiville be in a place like this? No. Oh, cheap oil. Let's get those. So we can sell them. In Slutsk. I'd better check just to be sure, but actually bullets might, might be a fortress as well, yeah. And as far as I know the claimants won't be won't be in those. So let's lie and let's try these ones. Crimean grenade, because I get my native made a piece. These are Latvian lands, but uh, might as well check here as well, and eventually I will check all towns. Yeah, I think it's just random. Random tavern in a town where uh, where Rotsville is. Christina is now here. Hello. Oh, excellent, excellent price for oil. Nice price for fish as well. Let's go for over 60. Well, I 
this object. Northern lands and then the lands of the Muscovite Jardim. And I have 19,000 on me. I didn't even realize. There he is! There he is! Yes! Where? Where is Ratchiville? Why didn't your... Your... Uh, <coughs> well, not your, but why didn't the other travelers have this information? He's currently at Varsava. Right. Maybe Ratchiville wasn't a, wasn't a move. I don't know. Well, now I know exactly where Ratchiville is. And that is Perfecta Mundo. And I will sell you butter, I will sell you powder, I'm so happy right now. Yes, 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 everything, everything is fine again. Mm. Smolensk and Cherkasi have my monies. Mm. Now that I know where Ratsville is, I kinda... I want to go, I kinda want to go right away. I will drop by in Kiev, put some money in um, put some money in the treasury or the merchants killed. First checked uh, check this one um, I really don't want uh, I really don't want any a Tatar helmet like that. Armor gauntlets. Rider gauntlets. Reinforced. Plus 10 body armor. Mm, do I invest in gloves? I guess I might. Yeah, I'm 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 gonna keep my village cap for now. That's what I'll do. There is no merchants killed here. Oh, that's interesting. Fine, I'll keep the money. Let's go talk to Ratsville find out what he wants. Where can I find some proper helmets? Come on. Better be here. Yes, you are. 
are. Yes, you are. Hello, Janus Ratzevel. I am Karl. Perhaps you have heard of my exploits. I am the Grand Hetman of Lithuania, Prince Janus Ratzevel. Yes, I know who you are. I thought Polish Commonwealth was ruled by King Jan Casimir. Oh, come on, Karl, you don't have to be like that. We Ratzevel are descendants of the Grand Prince of Lithuania. Jedi Minas. Just as the Jagiellon that ruled the Polish Commonwealth. Compared to us, the kings of today are just newcomers with no right either to the crown of Poland or to that of Lithuania. The Polish king is elected by senators. This is the root of all our misfortunes. The Polish Commonwealth shall never become a great nation until a true king reigns from the throne. One who would bear the title by right of blood and not by whim of the gentry. I need daring people to rise up against the invader and restore Great Lithuania. And I have full right as the elder of Smutst, the warlord of Vilna and the great hetman of Lithuania. Uh, well, actually I'm here <laughs> in a whole other business. So uh, tell me, Prince, why is the Black Maze so famous? How did you come to know of the Black Maze? That secret is shared between but few men of knowledge. It cannot be so great secret if parts sing of it in taverns. So that is how it is. Well then, you shall just have to ask the parts why it is so famous. Let us leave the jokes aside, Prince. Honestly, I feel a real connection with that maze and I want to find out what it is. The secret of Black Maze is kept by the ancient houses of Lithuania, such as us, the Ratsiville. These secrets are not meant for the ears of the strangers. And what if I become a friend to the Ratsiville? How could that happen? Perhaps by aiding you in winning the throne? Now there's an idea, Carl. Leading a rebellion against the Polish Commonwealth? Ah, I see. Well, then yes, anyone who would help the Ratsiville could count on their patronage. Um, I'll just double check the quest first. Yes, farewell for now. Secrets of the Black Maze. Okay. Oh, I totally forgot. I have that one. For Great Lithuania. Too bad the Kazakh sanctuary man. He swore that Ratsivil often spoke of the Black Maze. Now we have to find Janus Ratsivil and discover the truth behind the tale. And that I did. Ratsivil Rebellion. You found out that Janus Ratsivil might know the secret of the Black Maze. You have to begin an uprising against King Jan Casimir to help Janus Ratsivil take the throne. Wow. Wow. <laughs> that is insane. Do I need to conquer the whole Polish Commonwealth as rebels? With this guy? <laughs> to proceed with the Black Maze quest? Well, if it is so, it is so. I wish to take up your cause and help you reclaim the throne. Your words are a great comfort, but are you certain that you are equal to the task, Carl? Taking the throne is no simple matter. The nobles of our realm have all sworn oaths of fe fealty to King Jan Casimir. A very powerful man. Oaths to such super are invalid, of course, and we may expect some of the nobles to side with us, but it will be a very difficult and a challenging struggle, nevertheless. Well, of course it will be hard, but... Yeah, when I do this, the whole Polish Commonwealth nation will be my enemy. 
and potentially some other factions as well. So yeah, I'm ready for whatever may come. I have no doubt that your support for my cause is heartfelt, Carl, and I am grateful for you. But I cannot think that we have much chance of success. However, if you prove yourself on the battlefield and make a name for yourself as a great commander, then our friends will not hesitate to join our cause, and our enemies will be wary to take up arms against you. When that time comes, I will join with you gladly, but until then it would be wiser to quietly gather our strengths and not openly challenge the usurper King Jan Casimir. Right. What the heck? I'm supposed to just go and start fighting the factions to get some renown and then this fellow will... Well, sure, I'm only only level 8. I only have 25 free now. But how the heck I'm supposed to gain that renown? If I can't start a rebellion. If I start it on my own, like start fighting the Polish, or start fighting, fighting whatever, I don't have any reason to fight anyone. Well, this is disappointing. Like, do I need to join a faction? Start fighting just to... Just to gain renown? I guess that's the only, only reasonable way to do it. Otherwise it would be me against one faction. That's that will end fast. Hmm This was uh, unexpected. You have to begin an uprising. So I will just have to start it. You're not going to help me. Quietly gather our strengths. Mm. Well, I'm, I'm kinda thinking that could mean that I'd, I'd need to take... Take down one castle or something, but how the heck I'm supposed to do that with the army of 55? Hmm. Well, there is something I need to think about. I actually also need to upgrade some of the weapons of my mercenaries, so I will do that before I forget. Okay, so you can get the carbines. Cavalry. Some better melee weapons. For now. I don't think I've bought them anything. Flanked maze. Sounds good. Actually, if I need 
to go to war. Oh, this is this is very very tricky. I'll need some infantry as well if I if I try to take down a fortress. Hmm. No. Now I now I know. I will at least try. I will find a Polish Polish lord and uh, see if I can uh, see if I can convince them for the cause. Maybe maybe that's the case. Let's see. Is there a such option here? No, not really. demands. Mm, yeah. I don't know. Need to start uprising against Jan Casimir. 200 men in the garrison. Warsaw. 231. How am I supposed to do this? One seven six, one eighty. And I don't even know if if it's something if it is something I need to do. One hundred and a whole lot of lords. 